I've been on quite the detox diet. No, 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 uh, yes, good. Quite the detox diet indeed. <sighs> no more salt, lovely time, and my navy is in fucking tatters. So, let's continue off from where we left last time. I like for some reason that my super heavy battleship is listed below my battle cru- actually, all my stuff is listed below my battle cruisers. But anyway, welcome back to Monarchist Germany. So some people- some people had some issue with, um, France taking all of my land, and I did because I realized I should have done the focus afterwards, and they would have then given me Alice Lorraine back, but... No, whoops. Ah oh, well, I guess I don't get that then. Instead, what I'll do at some point is I'll just annex them, and then I'll release them. Um, actually, you know, let's start that shit now. Let's start with just... Ah, let's actually repair all my shit first, so... That shit goes to the top. Any, uh, civvy factories go to the top. I'm gonna want to try a few more stupid things. Some things I've learnt, uh, by the watching uh, other people's videos, or just talking to people and discussing Waking the Tiger. One of those being strategic bombers. Um, I want to build a massive air force to take on the, uh, the Soviets, and it's gonna be some good fun. So let's, let's get towards actually, like, repairing everything. First thing I'm going to do is put my uh, industry together and then I'll be back and we'll go on with what we want to do. The first focus we'll be doing is, of course, Bulwark against Bolshevism. It is just, it's such an annoying thing to say. Because like, I always end saying Bulwark or Bulwark. Look, whatever. Let's just fix my fucking industry. Alright, the Soviets have declared on Iran. So, here is my general idea at the moment. We've got... Uh, we're going to replenish all our units. So we're going to have, you know, the Tactical Genius and Veterans both being infantry. We've got the uh, Von Moseltov as well, who are... I think they're on the Romanian border? I don't know, someone is. Uh, but either way, we're getting all those guys back up to full strength. Uh, is there anyone here? Let's keep getting mechanized. I'm not really using mechanized just yet, but I'm tempted to use it for the invasion into Russia. Um, we're also pouring all of our spare, broken, shitty infantry equipment into Bourbon France. The good thing about that is you get it back once you annex them. So, yeah, I'm going to annex these guys pretty quickly. Uh, they were really close to actually breaking free to a colony. But now they're already dipping down again quite quickly, yeah. Master building and Overlord Lend Leasing is 50 a month. It's it's going to be great. It's going to be so good. It's going to be so good. It's going to be grand. Don't worry. Anyway, oh shit, are we... I just realized we're still building ports in Britain, which we can probably cut back on. Yeah, sure. Alright, so the other thing we're going to want is radars along the border. That's one thing I've just forgotten to put in, so I'll just put some orders in. There we go. Uh, for radars along the border to use with our new strategic bombers. I still need to assign all the air wings. I haven't done that just yet. Oh, here we go. The bulwark begins. Uh, sea to the eastern front. Oh boy, that's a lot of forts. That's a lot of forts. Thank you very much. Anyway. So we're rebuilding our navy. We've got, uh, basically it's getting a nice basis of four carriers. And then we're getting the second super heavy battleship in. And we're getting a bunch more ships. I just realized I haven't ordered any more battleships, which is what I need. Uh, Battleships Class 2, lovely. We're going to order at least five more of those, because they will ruin our enemies. Two Super Heavies and five Normals, backed up by a bunch of Cruisers. Screens are pretty rubbish, but we're still getting some Destroyers in anyway. Um, so yeah, we've got the Romanian Front obviously pushing in here. The two Infantry lads here. We also have a Improvised Dinghies. These guys have some Motorized with them, so they're going to be moving out of Ostbrissen. Alongside Rommel, who is going to try and cut off the whole lot of them in Poland. Uh, I've just realized Poland? Yeah, is Soviet. Right, okay. I was like, I was, no, shit, I'm getting confused with my Malron, which I just did, where Poland somehow came out of the war completely neutral and okay, somehow. Um, anyway. So we're gonna build a, t a ton of strategic bombers with which to ruin the Soviets' air infrastructure and generally just destroy them as we go. Uh, and we're gonna have a bunch of fighters too. It's gonna be a nice combined advance. I don't think we want to move off until we can annex... I don't know, it'd take a while to annex Bourbon France. Let's just... That could just be something that happens while we're at war. But I mean, I think we just want a little bit of a break to actually put our units together for now. Because right now, the power is definitely in the Soviet Union's favour. They have... Fuck me sideways. That is a lot of divisions. That is a stupid number of divisions. I'm almost tempted to go after the USA first, because... That's a better idea than, you know, going after the fucking Soviets. And in fact, I might. I mean, we can land. There's no reason to fight them at sea. That's a terrible idea. But we can just push in through land. It's entirely possible. Uh, who else is around here? The province of Canada is common turns. So there's no real reason to be afraid there. I mean, yes, yeah, scrap my plans. We're going to go in against the US because there's a hundred divisions in here. And we might as well try and take them out 
I mean, yeah, we have about equal divisions, but we have uh, more units, uh, sorry, more factories, I think. Yeah, way more factories and a lot more manpower than them. We might as well take them out. The thing we don't have is don't have as many fucking airplanes. We got 4,000 to their bloody 8,000 or 7,000 near on. So let's put together a force and let's go prepare to invade the US. Uh, what's the timeline on a declaration? 125 days? Yeah, let's just start declaring now. We want New England. Let's do this. You know, Lithuania has refused Memel. I think I can see why. But okay. Oh, uh, 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 um, um. Polish People's Republic gets guarantee for territory. Yes, I'll ask. I hope they say yes. Um. Anyway, let's go focus back on the US. Oh, the problem is currently my shoot my troops uh, troops aren't shipping out because of the lack of convoys. I think we might have solved it. Yeah, they're starting to land now. Good, thank God. This is gonna be a fun war. Um, what? Hang on, what? Hang on, what? Uh, they've put their faith on us and urge us to stand ready in case of Soviet aggression. Stand ready in case of Soviet aggression. Oh. They actually get the anti-Soviet pact, what? <laughs> I own Danzig now, I'm not gonna say no to that. What the fuck? Um... Oh my god, if one country in the pact is attacked by the Soviet Union, all others will be called to war. <laughs> I really, really hope the Soviet Union attacks me now. Oh, I fucking hope they do. Safeguard the Baltic. Let's, uh, yeah, turn Estonia and Lithuania away from communism. Estonia, how would you like the nice word of fascism in your ear? Um, can I not... Oh, I'm not fascist. Right, that's a problem. <laughs> it does suck that Unaligned can't boost. I uh, should get that mod that lets Unaligned boost and, uh, and swap governments. Anyway, we're almost ready to knock out the US. God, we have so many fucking airplanes. Look at this. We've got, we're also deploying the strategic bomber. Fun times. What happens here is you shoot down their airfields first. They can't put up a defense against you. And then you can just bomb anything you want. Um, but the problem being, with when you're advancing, it means those airfields you're capturing you then can't use. But oh well, this should be some good fun. Um, let's go. Did not know how strong our hardships have made us. Yes indeed, Americans. Yankee, Yankee, Yankee Doodle. Uh, how far? 70%? Cool. We are so ready for this. Oh yeah, I've got to get, um, our radar up so we can scan better. I need to, like, get better radar tech, but the, uh, the problem is basically... The higher your detection, oh, sorry, the higher detectioner is, detectioner? Yeah, the higher your detectioner, the higher your detection is, the better you can find the specific targets to take out. So I'm just pop these ones at the top. There we go. They were done in a moment. Beautiful. You get done by next month. All right, cool. So we're just upgrading all of this stuff. Um, I do need better radar tech. It's something I never really research, but like. If you can get a good radar in, like, one province at, like, level 5, I think, is that the max level? Hang on, let me go check. Because then I never, like, I always get, like, radar level 1 and just put it on my borders, but... What's the max level? Oh, 6, okay. So, radar level 6 is fucking massive, and I know Britain starts with a few... Do they start with radar 2s or radar 1s? So they just start with radar 1. I always do like Britain because they start with radars, but, yeah, I guess only radar 1. Anyway, um... Bourbon friends, what is happening here? Are you not? Oh, we're still delivering mouses. Right, okay, cool. Oh, dear old Bourbon France. How are we do? Oh, oh, we're ready. Let me just uh, manage my subject real quick. Good, you are still falling. Excellent. You'll be under my control before too long. Um, no reason to be afraid here. We seem to be okay. You're guaranteed the independence of a lot of states, quite surprisingly. It's sad that you haven't guaranteed your own. Alright. 24 divisions all round. Let's kick this shit off, shall we? I've also got my uh, Luftwaffe here. I haven't actually deployed them. Uh, I was going to wait and see where I needed them. So, yeah, sure. Let's just start by landing on Boston if we could. Landing next to Boston. Perfect. Um, right, let's go force attack on you boys. You've still got guys driving, but whatever. Oh, the Italians are here even. Uh, how's our air war looking? Our units are ready to deploy. Good, we do have actual space in our uh, in our air wings now. What is Okay, what is this division? Why is there an air support in the ocean? Sure. That makes no sense. Oh my god, look at look how buffed they are. God, that's so good, yes. 
Soviet Union declared war on Turkey. We had declared war on the Philippines. Oh no, we need to save Turkey! Shit! We need to save Turkey. That was the whole point. I, I can't actually make them. That's a, like, it does kind of suck that you can't... Uh, I guess I could like puppet the Ottoman Empire. But uh, yeah. God damn it. Anyway, let's see who, how we doing. How we doing? We're pushing all right. Our guarantee... Oh my god. So the Lithuanian independent SSL wants us to guarantee their independence. Nice. And we're also going to boost... Wait, we're going to support the Finnish who are going to get a factory output bonus from this. That's a little weird. Okay. And then we can com uh, we can go down the whole pact idea and then we can tackle them and then we can get the Iberian problem. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Let's uh, go support the Finnish, shall we? Alright, anyway. Uh, how are we doing here? We're punching through just fine. Oh yeah, there's this bit of land, but we can't really use it. Oh, I guess we could have put a f uh, port there, but who really cares? We're going to try and push on this left side here, but I might just stop the attacks in a moment, because we're probably not going to get far. Yeah, let's just hold up, guys. We'll uh, we'll get a little bit more planning before we do anything. Uh, just because I think they'll probably hold well enough on that side. But this side, not so much. Uh, have we got our planes here? Where are we? Transports, beautiful. Should be deploying here. Are you guys, aren't you guys part of an army? I guess, I guess not. Alright, uh, you guys join up here. And... Here, sure. Just get double boys. Lovely. Okay, let's, uh, let's deploy our paratroopers. Here we are. Yay! Capture Boston immediately. Go, 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 go. We have a lot now. We have 13 paratroopers. Oh boy, oh boy, come on. Just, just hold on for a moment. Take Boston. Good, perfect. Um, Alright, let's start spreading out here and get a nice little front going on with our Luftwaffe. We'll push down to New York if possible. Go, boys. Go, boys. Has only got one ball, the other is in the... Uh, I should have fucking... I should have used glider planes. I'm an idiot. Whoops. But actually, if we can... Punch through here. Oh, these are only the light tanks, right? Old Hickory and Titan divisions are holding back. Who's this? Alexander Patch is holding the line against us. He's a brave boy, but he will be soon overrun. Um, let's just punch in here and take bang or bang or what? Christ, I'm a comedian. All uh, right, let's keep on moving on. Providence, ah oh, yes, lovely religious town. I assume at least because that sounds very religious. Oh my fucking god! Look at these strategic bombers forming Voltron. The amazed. Oh my god! The, the fighters are coming in as well. No, the Americans are trying to stop us. Fucking Yankees. But yeah, look at this. Let's see the shit that I've captured. I've already, I've already bombed a factory. Oh, there we go. Already ruined the infrastructure and completely removed the uh, the level 10 airbase that was on this province. That's how good uh, strategic bombing is these days. And in fact, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to push the strategic bombers down. So, yeah, down to here. There we go. Just start bombing this province. We have 500. Might as well. They're going to put planes against me to try and stop me, but good luck because... Oh, okay, they're starting They're starting to disrupt me. Okay, okay, there we go. We've actually deployed some planes. Uh, could we... Can't really deploy... Is, is heavy, heavy fighters still a thing? They're a thing I literally never researched. Uh, oh, they are too. Should we get some? I feel like we should get some. Well, let's let's get some heavy fighters. Uh, next next uh, use that we can... I don't know, do we... Mm. Alright, let's reassign these boys back down to here. We've done enough damage. We blew up plenty of buildings, but uh, we don't want to lose too many of them. They're expensive, those strategic bombers. Alrighty. Oh man, they just keep leaving their borders open. This is lovely. Americans! Would have thought they'd be a little bit better at defending their borders, wouldn't you think? Come on then. Uh, is there anyone... How are we doing over here? Two... It's not terrible. Ah, oh, they've got the fucking... Uh, we need more decryption. But let's just try it. Press a line. Yeah, no, that is pretty terrible actually. Let's just pass on that. Okay. Oh, yeah, we need to... Oh, shit, that's what... Uh, I need to level up my fighter. Fighter level three. Yep, here. I'm going to boost you to have fuck tons of range. Bit of reliability. Bit more weapons. Cut back on the reliability. Loving it. All right, this is my new fighter. Terrible reliability. Horrific, even. Actually, we're going to probably drop a range a bit to boost reliability. Yeah, that'll be fine. Um, and there we go. We can, uh, we can make these boys our new fighters. And army experience. I guess we can boost up our tanks as well. Have we got the gra- yeah. Wow. Oh, wow. We oh, right. We were trading with the US for all our oil. We need to- Venezuela? Hi, yeah. You're our oil boys now. Also, just realized we haven't deployed our navy, but just in case, we're going to put out the Kriegsmarine 
to the English Channel. Oh, oh, excellent. It's what? Here we go. This is the button I want to press. Lovely. Yeah, there we go. All right, just to secure that stuff, just in case they wanted to come and threaten uh, Germany. Cool, lovely. Oh god, we're pushing down. We're about to meet up our lines as well. It's gonna be grand. Come on, boys. Wait, who's not attacking? Oh, the tactical ding uh, dinghies aren't attacking. Whoops, I just realized they weren't... Uh, I've been stopped this whole time. Oh, well. Beautiful little surround going on here. Oh, this is weird. Oh, they've captured all those Italian convoys here. Poor boys. Yeah, I've been trying not to ship in more things, man, because... Christ, the, the convoys after the last war, we had none left. Just shipping my troops across to uh, America was a bit of a challenge, because I just didn't have any bloody room uh, on the boats to actually move them all across. Oh, here we go. We got uh, full up. All right, let's boost that. Let's get back to making France a terrible place to live. Uh, I mean, a great place to live, rather, and therefore they will become Germany. Come on, then. All that infrastructure. Couple of factories. Are we not? We can't. can't okay, can't build factories. Here we go. I will be taking all your land back. Don't worry, France. Oh, fuck. I just realized this whole time I haven't unpaused my timer. Oh, well. Anyway, we're going well enough here. All right, how are we doing? Oh, shit. We need to bring our lines down now that we've uh, reached this point. I do quite like that I've made my Panzer Divisions completely black, and so their line is just sort of weirdly greyed out. Oh, shit. Oh, that's not good. That's a naval invasion noise on Florida. Oh, right. I own the Bahamas. I don't know when this happened, but I, I own them. Excellent. Shit, I need to cut back on these tanks and put more into light tanks, because holy fuck, we do need to do that. Let's uh, upgrade. Oh, this is so nice that you don't have to do multiple lines anymore. There we go. Advanced cannons. Need a few more in each of these. In fact, I might put a whole line of, uh... Here we go, yeah. Six more. You know, we could, we could do with, like, ten more factories back at home. God, I love having the quick endgame build speed. It's just so bloody nice. Nice. Let's, uh, ship in some more oil. Do we want to go... Let's get in Romania. Sure. And I guess we can get the remainder from Soviet Union. Sure. We're gonna need it, just for, just for fighting this war, at least. But soon enough, we'll have the American oil fields under our control, and we'll be happy as all... Uh, what? Have we not... Come on, this is this is not me being happy. What, what is this? Why have we not dealt with these guys yet? Come on, then. Really? This is, uh... This is how we're treating surrounds these days. We just sort of leave them be. Okay. Seems fair enough. You guys want to actually roll back and do something about it? Come on. Oh, righty, yeah. Still not breaking through on this side, unfortunately. I'll try and focus a few breakthroughs if I could. That's working not terribly. Uh, how's the air support around here? A lot better than on our side, for sure. Oh, hello. Uh, they're trying to stop us. And am I... Uh, don't detach. Where did my strategic bombers go? Here they are. Good. Keep bombing New England. The problem is... Okay, these fighters are coming from, like, the south, so... I could grab my bombers and stick them in there again. There we go. Ruin their locale. Before they send some planes over to stop me. And, okay, they're sending planes to stop me. And so we send our planes back to New England. We're also going to put down some ground crews to just boost up our, uh... Planes in the area. Cool. Let's get some heavy fighters. Sure. Where did those bombers go? They're at the top, weren't they? Yeah, here we go. Up to the new version. Hey, lovely. Let's just crush all these guys real quick. No, no, start here, go down here. Lovely. God, we're actually getting a bit of normal lag. That's a little weird. No, Rommel, stop getting yourself cut, mate. Come on. Also, I'm pretty sure some... Ah, uh, oh, William List as well. Sport the fins. Lovely. How are you feeling there, fins? You, you, really, you really like my guarantees? Of course. Let's get ideological defences. Anti-ideological, uh, anti rather. As in, against the communists. Right. Start murdering these boys. Ah, oh, shit, that's right, I need to get more radar. Right, radar tech. We'll get that next. Alright, moving on down here. Just want to slowly press this line wherever I can. If I can get a bigger front line, I can probably start punching through. Because i got nine to a province where they've got four. So they're going to hold me on a smaller line, but I can, uh... I could win them on a bigger. Especially as they start to get more and more pressed on the, uh, the right side. I've decided the navy needed some blooding, so it's gone to war. Oh my. Look at these precious little boys. Oh, there's a cup. Oh, there's even a car. Oh, there's even a cow. Oh boy, they've, they've joined, with more, joined with more people, but here we go. Did you just declare war on Estonia? Did you just declare war on Estonia? Did you just declare war on Estonia? 
we better formalize this treaty pretty quick. Because, oh boy, that's that's not okay. Also, stop sending me your shit. God damn it. Hang on, let me just... What do we what do we want here? Radar stations? Sure. Radar stations, all throughout here. And, and anti-air defenses. And... D d how much longer? Not long. Okay, good. Wants our help in our war efforts. What? Oh, shit. Oh, uh, but, but, but wait, if we, if we join Estonia, no, no, I can't, I can't, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Estonia, I cannot, because if the pact goes off instead, everyone should join against the Soviets, which is a much better idea, uh, and I'm also going to quickly push out some units, because I might need to defend a line pretty soon, yeah, three lots should do it. So let's just cl oh wow excellent job there Remy you're the smartest man around ah thank you Remy ah, no worries back to you Cotton all right let's try and take this province back come on ungetreten ungetreten all right someone translate what does ungetreten mean stick it in those comments boys oh yeah um forty thousand subscribers right I forgot to mention that that's I guess that yeah that would have happened by the time this video goes up holy shit thank you guys it's insane that we've hit 40,000. Like, such a weird tone change in the middle of this video. Good job, Remy. But no, uh, fuck yeah, that's that's an amazing. Oh, such an amazing feeling to actually hit that. God. I've always wanted to do this since I was a kid, and here I am fucking doing it. It's it's great. And uh, every every subscriber counts. Everyone helps. Everyone that watches lets me do, work my dream job. It's, it's great. Hell of a fucking life. Now let's kill some fucking Americans. Come on, you Yankee cunts. Hey, there we go. Francie, Francie, Francie. Let's discuss your annexation. Lovely. Goodbye. All of your troops are mine. I'm actually going to keep the divisions for now. Oh my god, they had 140 fucking six. Give me a moment just to organize these. They're going to go sit on the Soviet border. I think I've found the same bug Bo found. Yeah. I have no planes in this area. I mean, actually, I have some strategic bombers, but they're not actually bombing anything. I assume they're just out of supply. Yeah. Look how many planes we're killing every single fucking day. There was seven at one point. Seven a day killed by zero fighters. Not even not even strategic bombers. There we go. Just seven just then. That uh, Owen oh, Rommel's been wounded, you fucker. There were seven just then. Yeah, this is this is a weird bug. Unless this is just their, like, um, what's it called? reliability being super low and they're all crashing or something i don't know but either way yeah that's weird yeah man very strange oh hello you can blow up the suez canal that's fucking cool oh wait no i, I saw this on the subreddit uh so yeah suez canal what happens if you blow it up is it just breaks down um and you can't use it that's it. they're the enemies well no one can use it rather so if you do it when the thing gets recaptured you can basically blow it up and then uh stop them from using it once, once like, the British recapture it or whatever. Which is what I assume would happen. Uh, you want to stop the British from moving their fleet through. That means it's, like, that means it's a good idea to, like, push the Suez Canal, blow it up, and then run away as a, uh, what do you call it? As, like, um, Italy, I guess? Or, or even Germany? It means there's a reason to push for North Africa, but not actually fully focus on it, because then you can try and focus having, um, National Spain and taking out Gibraltar. Once you've taken that out, that means the Mediterranean is closed off to the British. And there's only one entrance. You know, it means you can fight like a North African war. You basically close off the supplies from the north. So any of their ports up here, any like of Egypt's ports, just get fucked. This would be rather nice. Not, not, not a terrible game plan. Like, even if they recapture it, that is. Then again, it would just be better to hold it. Um, uh, right. Shall we actually push now? I think we shall. Oh, this has taken a while. What's the time? It's 8.30. I should have eaten dinner like an hour ago. It's taken some time. But I've got a plan. Finally, 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 we've burnt the Americans down to their last reserve. Oh, switched to... Shit, they've switched to service by requirement. So they're going to be pouring all their units into uh, their divisions right now. They just run out of manpower. I am attacking with the ring. I, got, I found units keep dying for some reason. I think it's because of attrition and like they're just running out of strength really quick. I feel like it's just these low strength panzers are dying rather fast. But in every way possible, we're going to try and ruin the Americans. 
We've got some success over here. You can see their units are starting to fall apart. I'm ruining their uh, their factories as well with my strategic bombers. I've got pretty much air superior, uh, superiority everywhere. I've got naval uh, superiority as well. I'm covering my coast now. These guys got in before I did that, so I'm just starving them out. And using my paratroopers to keep them busy. Uh, I am bombing them with everything I have. If we can look here, I'm currently just bombing everything. Uh, near on, I'm not bombing ports and forts and coastal forts and naval dockyards. No real reason. I guess I'll let naval dockyards. Sure, fine, whatever. But yeah, here we go. We are pushing on hard. Hopefully, soon enough. If I, I want to get like a separate unit to focus on, but we don't have enough bloody... Don't have enough room in the airfields right now to have a separate uh, strategic rom bomber unit. But anyway, pushing on. About to capture the next airfield from them. This is going good. The biggest problem is honestly just the Soviets have a fuck ton of volunteers here. Like, how many bloody volunteers? There's, I, there has to be at least, like, 20. At the very least. And there are a lot of very good Soviet volunteers who are blooded by the multiple wars those filthy communists have been in. But, uh, let's... Oh, shit. Keep on pushing. And, uh... God, the problem is they're going to start getting their pop back real quick. Yeah, because they've switched to service by requirement. They're going to start filling in gaps really easy. Oh, alright, I didn't realise you guys had done that, but alright, let's just send some guys to go kill you. But no, it's like, a little bit of work, we can start pushing them back, but it's still not going to be enough, because they've just switched to service by requirement. It's going to really feed them. It's going to feed them double what they had before, which is going to be a bit of a bitch to deal with. Alright. Let's keep digging in then, I guess. Oh no, we're taking a bit more land. Alright, this isn't too bad. It's not too bad. How, how are they sitting? Are they sitting pretty? Because I've got 2.8 million right now. They keep running out, but they're not running out. Of, they're not running out permanently. They're going to refresh some every single day. It's going to be a little bit fucking awkward. So I'm going to start turning on some big radars here. Uh, have we got any more airfields we can use? Uh, we're taking over. Oh, there we go. There's an airfield. We're going to stick some uh, fighters in you, just to make sure we can actually take over this area. Lovely. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, we're going in for their capital. I want to take their capital before I stop. A wild ace appears. Uh, before I stop at least the advance. And then wait, let them drown out some uh, some more resources and then repeat. Here we go. Lovely. I was doing a bit of a communist China mountains fort combo up here. Mountain fort river even. Uh, uh, not really. River friendly a little bit of it. Anyway. God, we are pushing well here. Okay, we are busting through on the left side. This, ah, uh, this wider front, this is working in our favor. In saying that, I think they actually match our numbers for divisions now, but it's not too bad because I am better than them. My divisions are actually good. They're spamming shit boys. I'm gonna boost that land attack. Let's see how, how are their divisions doing. Yeah, they got pretty ridiculous numbers, but I think their divisions are dropping off now because they're uh, dying to attrition and they have no men to replace them. But only a few of them. So because as they lose men, they'll be uh, they'll be getting more back. Let's just put some of those down. Fuck, what do we even want? Nothing really. I guess just more. Level 10 forts? Sure. Not going to do anything wrong. Around here, too. And then back at home, we can just set up a few more. We're actually running out of space. We're just building so much shit. I turned Britain into the Isle of fucking Oil as well. It's covered in refineries. I have so much oil purely from refineries. Here we go. Yeah. Extracted. Uh, there you go. That is, that is a fuck ton of oil. There goes the capital beautiful. Uh, hang on, hang on. Why is there Waffen SS and... God fucking damn it. Could you, could you just... Oh, shit. Stop. God damn it. God fucking damn it. God... Why do you... Why are the Nazis still in... I need to call my executioner. Because he was not very good at getting of all those fucking Nazis. God damn it. Alright. Either way, we're just murdering him. We did lose a lot of people in the advance. We're now losing three We've lost three million in this advance. Oh god, but how many? We're getting twelve thousand. Okay, we build like a, a division a day at this point, but they've lost five million so far. Okay, that's a good point. Yeah, we can actually. Oh, sorry, division a month rather. So every month we can replenish one division. That's not terrible, but uh, I'd rather have some more. So let's go capture all of the fucking U.S. How about that? I could have still joined no faction yet either, and we also have their. Uh, we now have their. Holy shit! Did I just see what I thought I saw? Oh yeah, they've got a reactor, and it's now mine, motherfuckers. Bring it on! God, this is beautiful. A lovely- oh, shit, they're done. Um, let's just send him across to Ghost Division, because I guess he'll need him. Is he not going to assign him? Oh shit, where's your line? Here it is. Go get assigned. Anyway, so this is the victory march of the uh, German Empire. Look at this. 
Bloody hell, the Soviets sent so many volunteers. This, okay, this used to be about 50 divisions. About 30 of them alone were Soviets in that, in that encirclement alone. I can't really see any more Soviets on the line. And in fact, killing these means the Soviets can send more volunteers, but I can't even kill this encirclement. Look how ridiculous it is. It doesn't even count as being out of supply anymore. No, there's... Are they feeding it via the air, I wonder? They must be. All right, I'm gonna just deploy all my uh, rando planes I've got lying around just over them. Because fuck these guys, they need to die. Look, I have so many planes just sitting here. Um, all of these planes come to here. Yes, 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 good. And just sit over top of this guy. Uh, we got a bloody... Yeah, you. You can move to here. And still stay on top? Lovely. What are these guys? They're just fighters? Yeah, shift to here. It must be they're getting support from the air. Because there is no way they're still, like, alive at all. Oh my god, we're dealing 14 damage with close air support now. My god. I, d I do I do enjoy watching this damage done 15 uh, no what was it five not 15 Jesus I do enjoy seeing the buildings bombed as well we've got um, two sets actually three sets of bombers now I think these ones are just targeting airfields yeah I'm just targeting airfields with these no need to target the other infrastructure because I'm currently capturing it I think these guys yep yeah, cool meaning I think the really like only left airfields are sort of southwest central USA. I can move these guys down as well. Is there anywhere else I can put them? Not really. We need to upgrade these uh, air wings. There we go. And we've got beautiful radars just being put on as we go along. That's great. Look at this. Look at this. Oh shit, we lost. Oh, what, the, what, what, what is this? Come on. Come on. What is. I, I went from look at this to what is this? Come on. What's. Uh, it's alt. Right. That didn't work. I oh, right click. Fucking, I'm an idiot. Okay. God, we have killed a lot of them, though. What's that? Six million now versus our 3.6, which is not great. And they are still getting their manpower back, and this whole time we've been fighting that. We've been trying to... The reason why I haven't stopped pushing is because I've just been trying to fight their curve of manpower coming back in. So they will keep losing divisions. Um, but that's fine. What are we doing here? We Can we get a few more? Let's get a few more uh, heavy fighters. What do we need? Mechanized! Something I haven't actually touched in forever. God, we don't even... Why are we shipping in oil? Yeah, stop that. Jesus, I just realized we were shipping in oil. Whoops. Let's keep that up. Special projects, anyone? No. Uh, oh, hello. We can develop the oil fields. No no reason to. We already have plenty of oil. Actually, are we on, like, closed or whatever? Because I was going to say, if we exported to market... Wait, I was about to say, if we exported to market, we'd make a lot of uh, city factories. I just realized there's no one to export to. No one's actually going to buy our oil because we've killed most of them. No one actually needs it. I don't really know where to put these factories. I have too many of them. I guess just fill out these. We have tons of support equipment and uh, infantry equipment. If we look here. Oh, wait, no. Did we just run out? Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry, we have plenty. It's just of the uh, the latest type we run out. Yeah, there is there is nothing we have problems with. Look around here. Got all the invasion. I guess you get the last of that tech. We can get some uh, bombs as well. Get some conversion bonuses, maybe. I don't really know. We can do whatever the hell we feel like. Because we have so much technology. This is going to be an amazing final showdown against the Soviets. I don't normally play for this long. It's 1947. Jesus. Like, uh, it's going to be a great final showdown with the Soviets. We've been recording for two and a half hours, and of that, you're probably going to see, like, 20, 30 minutes by the end of this episode. Well, we'll, we'll see. We'll see how long we get to see. Uh, in the editing, that is. That's what I've got to figure out. Hunting the last of these boys down. The biggest problem was just losing my uh, divisions. Like, see, I'm still losing a few here and there. Stuff like this. I assume they're just starving out of gear or whatever. I don't know, it just seems to be happening very often. I don't know. I don't know if it changed like a... Changed the way it works. God damn, the Polish are here. Polish, I'm literally... I've got like a guarantee on your independence, Poland. Chill, dude. Chill. We're in an anti-Soviet pact together, Poland. My god. Come on. Come on. Can we capitulate the Americans already? We're getting really bloody close. We've been bombing a lot, but it doesn't really make enough of a difference. Everyone seems to have 80% surrender nowadays. We've made 13% effect on their war support, but they're just too happy. They're too happy to be at war. Those Yankee doodles. I don't know. Let's get the last of our air research out of the way. No real reason not to. Our navy as well. Let's have a look at this. 98. We're about to crack that 100. God, it'll be beautiful when it does. Let's actually just get it on the repair. No reason to uh, keep her broken. There we go. Got our Luftwaffe here. Let's, uh, let's send him off for a bit of a fly, shall we? Oh, never mind. No real need. Just realized we're on the doors of Los Angeles. 
Here we go. March on in. And... Here we go. Man, San Francisco's a lot bigger in Old War Blues. Hmm, yeah. Feels like it. Here we go. Kill these guys. Beautiful. Let's just see as we approach the close. 6.5 million probably in total, and I'll probably say 3.8 million in total for me. Like, that'll probably... That'll be the casualties we'll end up, most like. Let's just cut down the last of these boys. Here we go. Lovely. Again, way too much... Oh, I've got heavy fighters now that I'm not even using. God, I, I guess switch these to 10s. And I, we're already... I have a full 150 line of artillery that I'm not even using. I guess let's switch up to mechanized equipment. Let's get a whole line of mechanized equipment going on because we're going to switch some boys into that soon enough. And some tanks stuff. Let's let's put some more medium tanks in, some more... There we go. We've got plenty of light. And then we're just going to use all of our production to just produce an absolute fuckload of uh, factories. Here we go. Actually, you probably want to go back through our backlog first. Yeah. All this stuff up to the top. There we go. God, I love how fast things get built at the end game. It's just like I have ridiculous numbers of factories. It's so nice. Here we go. I'm not even looking at my front lines. I'm probably going to win. Don't worry. I'll be fine. Jesus, a lot of this is down to my bombing as well. The bombing isn't precise. You will sometimes hit the wrong target if your uh, information isn't completely accurate. The higher your radar, the better your chances are. Here we go. Going to finish. I've also got this at max now. I guess I could upgrade my infantry in another way, couldn't I? What, uh, what way do we want to expand it on? We've got a spare slot. I guess just signal companies? Signal companies are quite nice. We could also go logistic. No, logistics, because we're about to have a lot of supply issues invading the, uh, the Soviets. So yeah, let's logistics the fuck out of this. Come on, then. We've almost finished here. I need to go eat dinner. Fucking God damn it! I'm starving. Come on. All right, Florida. Let's send these boys down. All you guys get down to Florida. The devil went down to Florida. I mean, I'm pretty sure he does on a daily basis. Fucking Florida, man. Right. Come on. Shit, San Fran's not falling. Come on, something's got to give. Is that... So oh, good, that surround's finally gone. And these guys have decided just to sit here. Because they've got... Wow, that was an entire army dedicated to that surround. I didn't even realise. That was a full army that was doing nothing but trying to take on that surround. That's fucking... That's kind of sad, to be honest. Oh, shit. Their capital is surrounded. Let's take that army. And kill their capital with it. Here we go. Cut off these boys. Come on. They're almost gone. Keep putting the pressure on. Oh god, what else needs an upgrade? None of this. We do actually have outdated naval equipment at this point, but it doesn't really matter, because we just have so bloody much of it. Um, and such a such a well-trained Kriegsmarine as well. Oh god, they, they look like mini destroyers now. No! Shit. Looks like a mostly destroyer fleet. Oh shit, I lost my carriers. Well, let's just get more. It's not going to be hard to get those. Anyway, let's uh, send these boys. These guys are in for repairs now, aren't they? Yeah. But here we go. So we have, what, 94 destroyers. I'm aiming to have 300 by the end. Ten. Oh, I'm just going to fill up the numbers. I want at least double digits of most things. And a nice number of... Uh... Oh shit, I just realized I'm building a lot of these. So we go, we'll build four more super heavies. Three more uh, carriers. Even though they are only carrier ones, that's still fine. Building a bunch more subs. Yep, there we go. Getting double digits of the light cruisers. Uh, getting a few more battleships. Let's actually put, like, an order for three more in. And then anything we need past that is heavy cruisers, which are quite nice ships. I'm going to put in an order for, say, ten. Yeah. There we go. We're going to have a ridiculously good navy, and I cannot wait. I mean, we already do, but I want to have it even... I mean, I'm not sure why I'm building it so amazingly. The Soviets have a very rubbish navy, so... I mean, it's, I, it's, it's nice at least. Here we go. This will be it. This will be the surrender, most likely. Let's push on San Fran as well. Oh, come on. Come on. I want to see him say goodnight. Anything down here? Sure. New Orleans. Let's take that. Has Florida fallen yet? Surprisingly not. They've actually managed to surround my division somehow. Let's just convince them not to do that anymore. And also take Florida while we're at it. Perfect. Oh, yep, here we go. Yep, yep, here we go. Florida was Florida was the final straw. They couldn't live without it. Come on. Take the bloody state. Oh shit, we are just overrunning them at this point. 
Let's have a quick look. So, they, wow, we halved their division number in the time it took us to invade them. 6.67 million, 3.85. Pretty close, I'd say. Pretty close to my estimates. Let's, uh, let's drive on in. Come on. Fuck, they are really holding, aren't they? How many divisions here? I do fucking hate this, where you can't see the division number. It is so annoying. The fact that I have to have radars everywhere just to see division numbers is such bullshit. What are all of our units wearing fucking stealth gear these days? Has recon just not exist in this fucking day and age? No, we can't send a scout party forwards. Anyway, guess what? It's time to take over the entirety of the fucking USA. Thank you, Gunter Hast. Oh, God, this is going to be beautiful. Yep. Get the last of it. I, the main reason I'm doing this is actually just for the manpower, even even the non-core. I don't really feel like training puppet manpower, but I do feel like, oh, the beauty of having 700 million population non-core. It, it ekes out a little bit more, plus I now get to build all my uh, factories here. God, that's beautiful. I will see you next time for the final showdown with the Soviets. I need to redraw a lot of battle lines. Not sure if you noticed as well, this is my uh, my Frenchies army. Yeah, they're uh, they're just literally... Chilling, ready to take on the Soviets. I'm gonna go eat some food. I'm so hungry. Bye bye.